So hi everybody, welcome back to another video. Um, this is gonna be quite a short one, not a particularly long one, but it is gonna be an office tour. Um, now I recently, um, for long-term viewers of mine, or if you've been following me on Instagram or whatever, you'd know that last year, I swapped all the rooms around. So I moved into Anna's old room and Atticus moved into my old room. So the office used to be Atticus's room. Then after the bedroom swap round, it was a bit of a storage room, um, a bit of a dumping ground really. And I'd always wanted an office. Um, so I thought, right, January is the month. I am doing it. So I have done it. It is completed. I'm just waiting for one more thing to arrive, but it is pretty much done. So I am going to show you the office. So welcome to my office tour. Okay. So like I say, this used to be Atticus's old bedroom. Um, it's the smallest bedroom in the house. Um, but somehow without an actual bed in it, it looks a lot bigger. So, if I give you a quick overview, then I will start at one corner and work my way round. There is one thing I'm waiting for, and that is a print to come from Etsy um, to go on that wall there. But apart from that, everything's done. So, if I move back and show you a bit more there you go right so we'll start over here so obviously we have this cupboard here which obviously has always been here um, this was completely sorted out and I now keep in there um, all the suitcases which is really handy um, we have two great big suitcases and we have a medium-sized suitcase and then we have the carry-on suitcase so they all fit in there and also Christmas decorations so that is all pretty much sorted in there dead dead handy as we come down here we have a futon um, so this is for when Anna stays over um, I did buy her actually a blow-up bed <clears throat> previously for when she came to stay um, she wasn't having any of that it wasn't comfortable apparently but I think this is going to be a lot better for her I also wanted something in here that was going to be aesthetically pleasing also um, and can be used as a seat like I was working in here last night and Atticus came and made himself comfortable on this um, so it's a lovely forest green color they do these in lots of other colors um, this was from Amazon and I think it was 78 pounds um, and obviously it transforms into a bed so um, I will get a duvet um, cover and some extra pillows and I think that will be lovely for her and then she'll have lots of room in here like to spread the bed out um, and to put her things in when she does stay over so really like that love the color um, you know it blends in with the rest of the office so really really happy with that okay so as we move on up here the first picture print as such um, now I purchased this this was from Dunelms I'll try and tell you where everything's from as I go around this was from Dunelms and I'd say I got this a good four or five months ago maybe more and when I bought it I imagined it being in the office and I'm so glad I did get it it comes with all these little cards here which you can see so favorite view favorite country favorite city best family holiday and there's lots more it comes with loads more so um Atticus and I were doing this the other night and it was really really fun Atticus's um bucket list place was New Zealand which he has put there mine was Australia it would have been New York but we're going there so favorite city Atticus put here he put London he loves London um favorite place under here I've put Ibiza because it still is my favourite place. Um, number three on the bucket list, I chose this one, I put Sweden, I would really like to go to Sweden. Then here we have best family holiday, which of course was Florida Disney World, and favourite view was the Disney Castle, so far. But I think that one will change when we go to New York. But it's really good, you can swap it about, you can, um, for us we love traveling we love going to different places so this is just ideal for us and it's a lovely thing to have in the office and you can just swap these all about as you do your travels um, I think it was about 20 pounds I'd imagine they would still have it 
Um, and yeah, that was from Den Elm. So really, really pleased with that. Then if we come across here, we have this bookshelf. Now, this bookshelf is not new. Um, Atticus had this in here um, as a bookshelf when it was his bedroom. So I'll give you a quick pan down. There you go. And then we'll go through the shelf. So I've got my tripod just leaning on there. Then at the top, we have a fake plant. I think this is from Ikea, quite old. And then I've got it in one of these like... Um, paper pot things which i got a long time ago from um a shop in manchester when i was up there visiting um then we've got a reed diffuser of course now this one is really good um very very strong this is a habitat one i actually got the green to tie in with the futon um so yeah and it's really strong it's like a mint um scent it's lovely so that was from habitat at sainsbury's um, then we come down here and we have these two filing um, wicker things. They were from Ikea and they were six pounds each. You would have seen them in my Ikea haul. If you haven't, you can watch that down below. And I have filed all my house stuff, important papers, um, all things like that is filed in separate envelopes. Um, the envelopes I got from Tiger, they came in a pack of four. Um, so everything is filed there. I know where everything is. Um, each envelope is written on um, with what's inside the envelope. Um, so that's all done there. I'm really pleased with that because previously I had all like my stuff in like a like a box basically in different files so i'm really happy that that's all sorted then we come down here we've got these two wicker baskets here um i've got my banking stuff business stuff and that in there then i think in the one underneath we have envelopes etc um, now these little crates these were from urban outfitters again when i went up to visit manchester i think they were in the sale at the time um sellotape in that one then spare chargers um etc things like that in that one then at the moment in here i've just got them little um the cards that come with the atlas on the wall and the little pins so keep them in there then the next shelf I have another straw basket this came in the set from b m with them too um, I think they still do it. And in here I have my laptop case for obviously when I take it away places with me. Um, I've tried to do everything easily accessible. Um, I've got my travelling thing here, which obviously I will use if I go abroad. Um, I'll use this for New York to put the passports in and all bits like that. Really handy. Um, I got this for New York the other day. Um, keep that in there. The USB port worldwide travel adapter plugs. You can charge... Uh, a few different things at once so I thought that would be handy in New York so keep that in there for now and then down here we have the printer um, I bought this I think I've had this a couple of years now um, just a normal HP printer um, can do it all through the app on your phone um, so yeah printer self-explanatory okay so that is the shelves there everything organized um, yeah, really pleased with that. So I've ordered another print from Etsy to go here. Um, it's quite a retro botanical print, um, so that will look really nice. I will show that once it comes. Then we move across here, nice and sunny today. We've got a little windowsill. So I've got another J. I've actually got the um, natural wood J on my desk downstairs. That was from Next. And then um, when I was in there the other day, I saw they do the blackwood ones now. And I thought that's ideal for the office. Um, so that's from Next also. And so was this um, lantern, which I put a fake um, tea light in. Um, Next have actually got like a whole new industrial type um, range in, which I thought would fit in perfectly with the chair and also the lamp that I'm going to show you. So... That's nice on there, not too much, just nice and simple. And then we come across here to the main area. Um, if I show you on the wall, first of all, because it's probably it's one of my favorite things, I think, this um, hanging, if you call it tapestry. Um, this was from Urban Outfitters and I got this, this was just when we went up um, for Christmas, actually. I bought this Christmas Eve um, with the um, plastic boxes I was showing you um, this was only £22 from Urban Outfitters they have got it online and I absolutely love that I think the colour of that ties in really well with the forest green down there 
if you know what I mean. So absolutely love that. Um, I can look at that while I'm sitting at my desk. Love it. Um, so then we have the desk. So the main desk, this actually used to be Anastasia's, what she had when she had the big bedroom up there. <laughs> so she used to have this behind the door as her like working area and when I sorted that bedroom out or it was like no I'm going to keep that desk um I wasn't sure that I was going to turn this into an office at the time um but something just thought no keep the desk keep the desk because I really liked it and I'm so glad that I did so it's a pretty big long desk and we have a drawer there and it just all matches perfectly um the black with the the black on the chair really glad I kept that desk um and then the um desk chair this was from Ikea I got this very recently um you can watch my Ikea trip and haul down below also I picked up this um and also the seat pad this again industrial styling um this was 50 pounds so really pleased with that and it is comfortable it's really it's ideal it's a really good seat to sit at if you're on you know at a desk on the computer it, it's ideal supports my back also so really pleased with that okay so top of the desk oh now i love this i loved this light um i knew i wanted a little lamp in here a little light for at night so it's all nice and cozy but still bright enough for me to be able to work and um i found this and this was from b m which to me, it doesn't look like it came from B&M, if that makes sense. Um, again, industrial styling. It's from their industrial range. A different place that's doing industrial range. Um, and this was only £15. Um, and I think it's just great just to hang in a hanging bulb. Um, obviously, the bulb didn't come with it. I bought that separate. Um, but it gives off a lovely light. And for £15, I thought that was just fab. And it goes with the industrial type styling if you know what I mean um so really pleased with that so then we come across we have my phone um holder here that's my Kia I think two pounds um then obviously my um MacBook I did toy with the idea of getting an iMac for in here which still is a possibility um but I really I just don't know it's a big investment and I just don't know whether it is a necessary investment at the moment but it it's in my head but I'm not sure so I haven't done it yet so in the meantime I just take my MacBook to and fro up here downstairs which does the same thing um then we have a pen pot now where was this pen pot from ah oh, the pen pot was from Wilkinson's and the three pens were from Tiger um as were these a little daily ideas book which i thought is handy to have there um and then this pad also one day is eighty six thousand four hundred seconds i've got a few of them i'll keep some downstairs on the desk and one up here i've done a great big stationery like shop at tiger they have such great stationery and really inexpensive and then here i've got one of these downstairs on my desk also a weekly planner which helps me with things like uploads and um, when certain things are going live etc um, then we have a candle on here. This is the one Atticus chose from Ikea. It's, I'll try and pronounce it, Jalbanium, Cedarwood and Patchouli. Um, so that'll look nice on there, nice and simple. Um, then if we open the drawer here, um, we have a calculator, um, post-it notes, highlighters, clips, um, SD card reader, list pads, more of them pads, another big pad, um, glasses, everything I need when I'm working up here, basically. So really pleased with that little that little setup there. And then we come across here, um, the basket. I got this from Primark quite a while ago. I have been buying things and putting them up for when I did this room. Um, and this was only, I think, £10 at the time from Primark Home. And then this plant, um, it's a fake plant. I didn't want to put any real plants up here. Um, I just wanted a fake one. And this is a nice one. This was from Matalan. Um, this is a recent purchase, so they still do have it. And it looks really nice. Looks really nice in there. A good size, but not too big. And that was 28 pounds so i am really really pleased it feels nice it's got nice energy in here a nice clear clean 
working space and it is really good for me to have that separate working space um i'm really enjoying it it feels good to have an office it feels good to be able to like have an official workplace if that makes sense and just to like have storage for everything and everything i know where everything is and yeah i'm really really enjoying it so i am really really happy with my little home office and then obviously it doubles up as a room for anna when she comes home so yeah, i hope you enjoyed my little office tour and i will see you again for another video